Hey everyone, Mark Dorsey, NFPS Limited, and this is just a quick video just to give you an update on what's been happening in September. And we've had a pretty busy month so far. We had our Restraint Instructors course run between the 11th to the 15th of September. We had 30 new people join us and have been welcomed into the NFPS family, including six beautiful people from Malta. And we had Jim from Australia and also Q from New Zealand. So we had an international course going on this year as well. It was absolutely fantastic. So if any of you guys and guys are watching this, welcome again to the family. Also that week I, I was actually in court, I was an expert witness for the court in a case which involved a teacher, a 27 year old teacher who restrained a pupil and I'll leave a link below to the, to the blog post that I've written about that because that might be of some interest to many of you, particularly those of you who are teaching in schools. We also had about nearly 60 people turn up for a refresher on the 19th of September, and it was great to see all the old faces come back again and, and to welcome everyone back and, and see everyone once more. And that's like a big reunion, so it's fantastic. And for those of you that were on the refresher, uh, you may have remembered Rab and Alex's talk. Well, I've actually videoed those for you, and I, I've got links for those, and I'll be sending those out to you shortly. Now, a quick update. In November, we've got a Conflict Management Masterclass running. It's a two-day course, uh, and that's going to be absolutely phenomenal because we've got Barry Winbolt coming to talk and Alex Hunter. Uh, Alex is going to actually do a whole session on tactical communications and NLP and coaching, and that's going to be really, really worthwhile. And for those of you that saw his presentation on the on the refresher course, you'll see more of what that's about when you actually come and attend that course. It, it is going to be a fairly limited course, and that's not a sales speed. It is going to be a fairly limited course. We're not you know, looking to put on a big course because we want this to be quite personalized. So we're looking for probably numbers of about 12 or 15 max. So if you're, if you're interested, there's probably a link below this, or I'll email me, mail out to you later on on this one as well. And final shout out, we've got the self-defense instructors course running on the 2nd and 3rd of October. I think we have one place left, someone's dropped out. So if anyone you know is interested, there's one place left. And on the 4th of October, we're doing all the micro teachers for the education training award. And it's really important, those of you that are teaching now, that you have an education training award is something that's getting brought up in court cases more and more often with regards to whether trainers are qualified assessors. And to be a qualified assessor, you need an, a, an assessor's qualification, which is what the EAT award is all about. Anyway, I just wanted to get this out for you. Uh, I'm, I'm just, excuse the state of me, but I've just finished a distinguished gentleman's ride, actually. I've just, just done a nice bike ride to raise money for prostate cancer. And for those of you that donated, thank you ever so much for doing that. That was a great ride, but I decided, as we all do with NFPS, just to push it a bit further. So we did roughly about 40 miles, I think, but I decided to go out and gun it and do another 80 miles on top just to actually do a bit more, really, and also gave me an opportunity to get out on my bike in the sunshine. But listen, that's all for me from now. I'll be in touch shortly, but um, there's probably links below this video to, to blog posts and, and course pages that you can have a look at. But as, as per usual, got any questions, get in touch. And we're looking forward to another busy October. Speak soon. Take care now.